friends, it's Dana. I want to share with you something that um, I just find very interesting in God's Word. It will just take a few minutes if you've got that. And it answers the question as to why it is that people that don't even believe in Jesus when they are upset, when they're angry, when they're in a traumatic situation all of a sudden and they're not thinking about what they're saying, that the name of Jesus will come out of their mouth. I'm sure you've heard it, Jesus Christ this, Jesus Christ that. And I wonder if you have ever wondered, as I used to, but now I know, uh, why it is that people do that? And out of all the names and all the words in all the world, why don't they say, um, oh Buddha or oh Rumpelstiltskin or oh whatever uh, but it's oh Jesus Christ and I just want to share with you why that is in God's Word in Romans chapter 10 uh, 1 through 4 and then down in 8 and 9 it says this brothers my heart's desire and prayer to God for the Israelites it's that they may be saved for I can testify about them that they are zealous for God, but their zeal is not based on knowledge. Since they did not know the righteousness that comes from God and sought to establish their own, they did not submit to God's righteousness. Christ is the end of the law so that there may be righteousness for everyone who believes. The word is near you it is in your mouth and in your heart that is the word of faith we are proclaiming that if you confess with your mouth Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead you will be saved and that scripture answers the question as to why it is that people that do not believe in Christ follow Christ uh, worship Christ, speak his name when they're not even thinking about what they're saying. And that is because, according to that scripture, the righteousness that comes from God is through Christ. And that word, that name, has been put in our mouths and in our hearts, my friends. So I want you to think about that. I mean, seriously, when you are angry and you use his name like it's just a common word, I want you, I pray that you will from this day forward, every time you do that, that you will remember that I told you in God's word, it says you do that because the name of your salvation is in your mouth. And I ask the Lord would help you to remember that and to think about that. And consider that and act on that. Thank you.